Good morning, my name is Gail Vergas, and today I'm going to talk about the power of music. Normally, I start each morning reading from a devotional called Jesus is Calling. Frequently, the message is about listening or looking for God as you go through the day. Listen for his voice or look for signs of his presence as you go through your days and nights. One of the ways I have found that God speaks to me is through music, especially at night. Back many years ago, our family was going through a very difficult time. As we got ready for bed one night, I told John I felt like my prayers were going to the ceiling and falling back down on the bed, that God did not hear them. That night, I woke up in the middle of the night and there was a praise chorus going through my mind. It was the chorus, God is so good, God is so good, God is so good, he's so good to me. I did not think much about it until Sunday morning when our pastor read from Psalm 42, verse eight. When he read it, I almost shouted out for joy. The Lord will command your loving kindness in the daytime and his song will be with me in the night a prayer to the God of my life. As those words registered in my mind, I wanted to get up and shout. God had heard my prayers and was showing me that although the praise chorus, through the praise chorus, he put in my mind three nights before, on August 31st, 1984, his answer that he heard my prayers. My answer did not come for almost two years, but I knew he'd heard, and I knew that at the right time, the answer would come. Now we're going through a difficult time, not only in our own lives, but also around the world. And once again, I have heard God speaking to me in the night through music. I believe that the only thing that will get us through this time is our faith and trust in God. We sometimes feel our faith being sorely tested, but Paul tells us in Ephesians 2, 8, for by grace you have been saved through faith, and that not of yourselves, it's a gift of God. And the Hebrews, the writer of Hebrews in Hebrews 11, 1 said, now faith is the assurance of things hoped for, the conviction of things not seen. A few nights ago, I woke up with a song from a long time ago going through my mind. It was written and sung by Michael Card, a Christian singer and songwriter. It's called, That's What Faith Must Be. The chorus, I think, beautifully describes faith. To hear with my heart, to see with my soul, to be guided by a hand I cannot hold, to trust in a way that I cannot see, that's what faith must be. If you would like to hear the whole song, check the link in the description box of this video. Be open to how God speaks to you in many ways, including music.